some of these kids have gone through hell, actually losing their family in front of their eyes, then taking a boat to a country that they don't even speak the language to, don't know, don't know anybody there, and they come here and they're still smiling. They, they just want to be happy and they want to be at peace. Greece is the gateway to Europe. Currently there's something like 300,000 or so refugees in, in Greece right now, mostly in Athens. It's a dire situation, it needs a lot of help. This is a global problem. It's not just on Greece, it's not just on the EU, so, I mean, at the end of the day we're all humans, we need to be humanitarians. These people aren't fleeing because they want to flee. These people are fleeing because they have to flee. Nobody wants to have this sort of life. While they were trying to migrate through Turkey, the Turkish army, they shot her in the shoulder and they shot uh, his, uh, her daughter in the hands. We need the help. Uh, it's not just saying, but doing. If not, we will disappear. If you see something happening and you think like, this needs to be done, do it. This man is having a baby in 15 days, so uh, if you can take him upstairs and get him some clothes. Because he's in dire need of clothing and milk for his baby. I think we're going to really look back at this and just remember that we're not going to be the same person that we were when we left in the beginning of May. Like, there's no way in hell that you could actually be the same person. Yeah.